biar mau cari latihan nian wah nian lah bau pingi ping dum dek ke kerugian macam ah kian cara biar nanti latihan dong bah mui bo ya raya kan si cak latihan si cak biar raya Saya dah mesti ah betul. I've been a neurologist for 22 years, and I have never seen anything more horrific than Nodding Syndrome. Nodding Syndrome is a neurological disease. It is a form of epilepsy. We've only seen this illness in children in between ages 5 and 15 in a geographically isolated area in northern Uganda and South Sudan. When they were in the camps, 1,500 people died every week. The attrition in the Sicholi tribe is becoming greater and greater. Now, their next generation is dying. It starts with just a simple nodding of the head. At one point, they tried to tie this to narcolepsy, but realized that these children were not going to sleep, but they were actually having seizures. A child can fall into a fire and not even know that he or she is burning. If someone's not there to pull them out, then they will burn up. We just don't have a clue what caused it, nor do we have a cure. He just had a seizure, which is why he's so lethargic. These patients develop other clinical symptoms including progressive cognitive decline. Their ability to function diminishes just incredibly. The mothers and fathers cannot go to their gardens to farm. Many of the parents have resorted to tying ropes around their children's legs and tying them to trees. At least they know that they can't get away. They can hurt themselves, but they can't get away. This man has four children that have nodding syndrome. This thing happens, but I don't, I don't know what, what brings this disease. I have not done anything. Why this disease come and destroy my children like this? This disease has been around for over a decade. We're just beginning to evoke upon further research. The bases have not been covered in terms of trying to find the cause. And that's why we're on the ground. We believe that the cure can be found. We are offering centers within the village communities, providing care to these children that can no longer care for themselves. We will be monitoring weight, height, how their medicines are working and how they're not working. It will be a way for the families to go back to work because they don't have to worry about their children wandering off. We want to set up centers like this for children who have been kicked out of school, who are horribly malnourished, who are not getting medicine, whose families are just being devastated by this. Okay, am I gonna get a smile? We would love to see these centers put all over the North because we know it's necessary. I mean, we registered 100 children today. This is an issue about humanity and it shouldn't matter where it is. They came back with the hope that they could start over again. And that's just not happening because what's following them is this nodding disease. <laughs>